bet there are a ton of lobster in back in those caves. Be free with me. We left the great protection of Hatchet Bay and started south down the rocky coast of Aleut. While ultimately we wanted to make Rock Sound, we decided to break our trip up into two steps. Our first stop would be close to Alabaster Bay and then later Governor's Harbor. Hey, let me go shut the engine down. Yeah, I'm not quite sure what this anchorage is, but uh, Ludacris, I guess Blue and Wyro left a little bit earlier than us today and got here. It's absolutely beautiful, very shallow in here. Uh, supposedly a lot of sand dollars, just crystal clear water, gorgeous. But right on the other side of these trees is actually a runway for one of the Alutra airports. Very beautiful. The kids enjoyed playing on the beach while I walked the shallows. There are a few starfish and a few conch shells. But otherwise, there wasn't a lot to see in this anchorage. Okay, we're headed out to try to get some lobsters. I have no idea if we'll be able to get any lobster today, but before we go all the way to Governor's Harbor, I want to take advantage of this spot with these rocks and uh, see what we can come up with. At least that's what we're hoping for. The visibility was terrible and we didn't catch any lobsters. So we went back to the boat and headed down to Governor's Harbor. All right, today we're at anchor. Wyatt is doing some of his school work on the computer and we've got our gen set running since it's raining and the solar panels aren't putting out much. So we're charging computers and phones and other electronics while we do this, making water running a water heater, as well as topping up those batteries. We hope to get underway later today and head to a fish fry in Governor's Harbor in Eleuthera. All right, the storm just passed, it's still raining, but we're going to the fish fry. We're all dressed up, mom's dressed up, Wyatt's dressed up, and the dinghy died. <laughs> Opens at six. We gotta wait. I was retired three years before Jenny was, so that's pretty much what I did. That was my life. That's amazing. Well, that was my job for three years, was to learn how to handle a boat like that. Okay. Okay, Jeff, what are you going to have now? What? Well, can we get a combination? Okay. Of, like pork and chicken and fish all together? Well, I got two people. Okay. Um, two people? Mm hmm Okay. All right, two All right, guys, come back. Oh, Alright, so we're still 
are in Government Harbor today and we went to the fish fry last night and I'll have to say that we may have um, drank a little too much of this drink they call the Bubba. It goes down way too easy and has way too much rum in it. Anyway, we're uh, going to head to the hardware store now. We have to get a fitting for our uh, water maker, um, an elbow fitting, and uh, so that we can um, reconnect our freshwater uh, flush. Anyway, um, and then I think this afternoon we're going to head either further south, 100 yards, um, to an or a mile or so to the next anchorage south of here, or we might start heading back up to the top of the river. We don't, we're not quite sure yet. You're gonna wake me in the paddle board. Did I wake you? Yes. All right, did you? <laughs> it took you down? Sorry about that. Why it's a little upset, because I hit him with a wake in the dinghy on the paddle board. So, he did okay. So we're getting underway. We're leaving Governor's Harbor. Been here for a few days and uh, enjoyed the fish fry. Wandering around just a little bit, but uh, you know, not really doing much, but hanging out. Um, now we're gonna go to another beach. Um, I think it's called Pow Pow Beach. And we will, uh, you know, hopefully we'll find a spot where we can get some lobsters because right now we're getting skunked. This anchorage where Wyro Blue and Ludacris are is called like Pow Pow, P A U P A U. Maybe it's Paw Paw, I don't know. And these are the pineapple keys. And we're going to go around to the back side of the pineapple keys and anchor near this little settlement. And mainly because they have a great restaurant that I think we're going to go have a pizza at. Here we are. It's a pow pow. No, we're not at Pow Pow Beach. It's me falling down. Alright, let's see where we're at. See how anchored up we are. You can see us. Little rocks everywhere, little coral heads. We got the anchor down in some questionable holding, and then we went to shore to snorkel and see what was we there. We go to the beach, and Jennifer throws a rubber duck for Tybee, who is desperate to get off the boat and do her business. Anyway, we're going to snorkel these little broken keys. That's what they're called. That's called broken key. And uh, hopefully we'll catch a lobster. Although I'm doubting it only because it's so close to shore that it's pretty easy for people to get to. But why it's gonna scout it. Aren't you, bud? While we were snorkeling, the forecast changed and we needed to get some protection from the northwest winds that were coming. So we had to move down to Kemp's Bite. So here we are. We are in Kemp's Bite. We were earlier today in um, Paw Paw and the forecast changed while we were out snorkeling and it called for the winds to pick up to 15 and be sort of from the northwest. And so that made that anchorage not very good. And so we just, everybody we were with, they decided to head straight to Rock Sound and we decided to come here to Kemp's uh, bite and it's pretty well protected from if you can get in tight enough it's protected from the northwest but definitely the north the northeast and the east it's really nice anchorage 
really nice deep thick sand only a few houses up here it's actually really beautiful these palm trees are gorgeous and then you can walk out to the Queens highways and hitchhike back into the settlement so that you can get some pizza at Mate and Jenny's anyway we're gonna go try our hand again to get something to eat for free and then we'll see Another beautiful Luther day. We're actually going to go over to this beach and see if we can find the path through these woods. It shows on Google Maps and it would take us out to the Queens Highway and then we could go get pizza. We're in uh, Kemp's Bite. Lots of little dead conch shells and uh, we were uh, talking to somebody. They paddled out to meet us. They said they were renting a small house next to a larger house up here on the hill. And that those people who own that house, they're uptight about people landing on their beach and that they didn't really want anybody in here in the anchorage, which really tough because, you know, we paid our money for our cruise and permit and this is a legit anchorage. So anyway, we're walking. There's actually a path that isn't part of their property that's up from their house that we could land near and then uh, walk to the road in the attempt to get some pizza. So right now, we're on a quest to get to um, Nate and Jenny's pizza place in Palmetto or South Palmetto Settlement. But that's what we're looking for. And let me check the map. We never did get our pizza, but we did get to enjoy this beautiful sunset in Kemp's Bite. It's a really beautiful place. If you're here in a boat, check it out. 